Hi everyone, it's Maud here and welcome to your meditation practice. I wanted to do this brief intro before you start your practice to explain the format of your meditation class today. Meditation for me, or as I call it, a personal peaceful moment of silence is a very personal experience. And so I want it to be a personal experience for you, which is why I fade out of the picture as I'm guiding you through your meditation. And I'll show right back up in the end to let you know I've been there the whole time and I have not gone anywhere. I'm just guiding you through your own personal meditation practice. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you. I hope you have a good meditation practice. Hello, everyone. Welcome to your 7x10 meditation practice for the month of June 2021. The theme for this month is going to be stress management. And for the next seven days, we are going to look for ways to handle, tackle, manage, or alleviate the stress that we feel in our everyday lives. Many of us know what stress feels like, but do we really know what it is? So stress is the body's natural response when it's in the presence of imminent danger, which actually helped our ancestors cope with hazards and difficult situations in the past. However, the stressors that we feel today in our modern lives look a lot different than they did thousands of years ago. We stress over work, relationships, finances, loss, failures, successes, even traffic or travel. Short-term stress doesn't actually encourage major health concerns to come up. It is the long-term stress or the chronic stress that we experience that we really need to be careful about. And it's because of the inflammatory responses that it invokes. And so for the next seven days, thank you for joining me in this journey because we're going to try the best we can to handle this level of stress that we've found ourselves in, that we've somehow accepted and normalized. And so without further ado, please take a nice comfortable seat. Perhaps you are crossing your legs like I am. Perhaps you also want to lie down on your back, on your bed or a cushion or your yoga mat. Take a moment to scan the body. Take a moment to let your hands fall in your lap if you're sitting or gently to the sides if you're lying down. Whatever it is you're doing, get any movements out of the way, any fidgets. And whenever you're ready, close your eyes or keep your gaze soft. Start by taking a deep breath in. And then open your mouth, sigh it out. <sighs> Breathe in through the nose. Open the mouth and sigh. <sighs> and do this one or a few more times as desired. Making sure that your chest feels open. Your body is relaxed, your fingers are soft, your legs and ankles are loose. Organize the body so that it feels settled. And then start to soften the breath. Breathe normally without forcing the breath to be long or short or to be deep. Take a moment to arrive in your space. Stay in one place, here.
you came into this class from a stressful situation. Just notice the difference you feel between how things are now and one minute ago. How putting ourselves in this space and in this place perhaps changes things within us or even outside of us. What that means is the stresses that we feel definitely influence not just our own behaviors and our own feelings and our own reactions, but the reactions of people, even animals outside of us. first class of this series, we are going to cultivate awareness and encourage observation over your personal stress. Notice the state of your physical body when you are stressed. Do your fingers tend to clam up? Do your shoulders tense up? Does your chest concave in? Does your jaw tighten? Perhaps the space between your eyebrows wrinkle. On a more internal note, does your heart rate rise? And does your body temperature rise as well? And you can feel yourself warm up from the inside out. Perhaps your stomach starts to make growling sounds. These are typical reactions when we find ourselves in stressful situations. What is also typical is that we do not take a pause to acknowledge them. We ride the wave, hoping they will all just go away. The first step to addressing stress is to be aware of it and to observe what happens once we experience it. When we stop to notice all these reactions, we learn more about ourselves and our triggers. And when we learn more about our triggers, we can recognize a pattern. And when we can recognize a pattern, we can foresee it and perhaps position ourselves well before it happens. In a way, awareness helps us plan for our coping mechanism and we are better equipped to handle it. If you are experiencing any of these reactions right now, start to deepen your inhale and surrender over a big exhale. Breathe into this very moment and breathe out any tension. Breathe in hope that you will get through this and breathe out a big sense of letting go. Do that a few more times without feeling pressure to have to do it perfectly. the breath resonate to your feet, up to your legs, your pelvic area, your belly, your hands and fingers, your heart and chest, your neck and jaw, and lastly your temples and your head. start to soften the breath and start to breathe normally and notice the changes that happen in between your breaths relax what you can relax and tell yourself this is all a temporary experience take a moment to notice how your body feels now be aware and observe the shifts then slowly bring your attention back to your physical space. 
wiggle your fingers and toes. Then whenever you are ready, open your eyes. Thank you for completing part one of the stress management 7x10 meditation series for this month. I hope to see you all again tomorrow. Namaste and have a good day. Bye for now.